This is a renowned fishing spot. Are you getting the itch to fish? Yes. I hear you, and I like what you're saying. I'll give you one of my fishing rods. We got the old fishing rod. And as an added bonus, I'll even throw in a little bit of fishing advice. First, you want to face the water, then use the rod. Focus your mind. If you get a bite, pull on the rod. Sometimes you can snag something immediately, but with bigger catches, you need time to pull on the rods. To haul them in. Okay. All right, we got our encounter for Route 111. It's a horsey. Pretty dope. All right, start with a Thunder Wave Jolt. It's paralyzed. And it's got bubble, of course. Of course, what else would it have? All right, level five means it's pretty low. We can't attack it. Let's throw out a Pokeball. All right, we got us a horsey. We got a horsey on the team, ladies and gentlemen. Let's check the Pokedex. Horsey, the dragon Pokemon. Horsey eats small insects and moss off of rocks. If the ocean current turns fast, this Pokemon anchors itself by wrapping its tail around rocks or coral to prevent being washed away. All right. Little horsey. What are we going to call little horsey? How about, will this fit? Nah, it's not gonna fit. Okay, so let's 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 do this one instead. Where are we? Where are we? This is Little Dragonette. This is Little Dragonette, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the team. Mm -hmm. All right, adventurers. Welcome to all play. I just destroyed my mic. Welcome to all play. We're here with more of the Pokemon Ruby Nuzlocke. Uh, I did a little bit of training of the team as well as switching in and out some members. Let's go ahead and take a look at our team right now. We've got Tough, our Adamant Aaron with the Rockhead ability. Uh, here are the stats. Look at that experience chair doing its business. And then it has Headbutt, Mud Slap, Metal Claw, and Takedown. We finally have a move to take care of that Rockhead ability. Takedown is a move that normally deals recoil damage. The user deals damage to the opponent, but then it also deals damage to itself. Because of the Rockhead ability, Takedown is just a really strong tackle. So I got rid of Tackle. That's dope. Proud of you, Tough. You are you are on your way, buddy boy. Next up, we have Sure, the Modest Wobbuffet with the Shadow Tag ability. Uh, it's holding a Petra Berry. These are the stats. That attack stat is so low, it's ridiculous. I'm scared to teach Sure any TMs. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. The attacks, Mirror Coat, Safeguard, Encore, and Counter. Nothing changed. Next up, we have Beacon, the Pidgeotto, the Rash Pidgeotto, with the Keen Eye ability. These are the stats, not holding anything. And the attacks, Tackle, Whirlwind, Gust, and Quick Attack. Nothing changed, once again. Next up, we have Mask, the Crit Master, the Jolly Spender, with the Own Tempo ability. No confusion allowed. These are the stats while holding the black glasses. And the attack, side beam, uproar, fan attack, and hypnosis. Mask, mask can easily get rid of any problem we put her up against. Then we have Jolt, the relaxed electric, hold, oh, I'm sorry, I did it again. With the lightning rod ability. Holding a Petra Berry, these are the stats. They could be a little bit better. I think of everybody, Jolts are what need to be improved right now, you know? And then the attacks, Rock Smash, Thunder Wave, Spark, and Quick Attack. Not a bad move set, honestly. And introducing Roll, the Relaxed Weeping Bell. I decided to switch Magic out for Roll simply because uh, we already have two other members on the team doing what Magic does, but better. So I figured if any time, if, any, if there's any time to switch Magic out, Now's the time. We haven't even used magic in a while. So we should switch magic out. But what for? For roll. Grass lets us cover another another one of our team's weaknesses. Remember, tough cannot handle water type attacks. So that's where roll comes in. 
Chlorophyll is the ability. Uh, it'll raise speed and sunshine. So she'll be super fast. I'm sorry, he'll be super fast in the sunshine. These are the stats. In the attacks, we have Acid, Poison, Powder, Vine Whip, and Wrap. This does what Magic was doing, like about half of what Magic was doing, a little bit better. So it's not that we don't need what Magic does, it's that we need it done well. And this does it a little bit better. This lets us diversify our team. That's our team, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, Tough is at level 25. Everyone else is at level 24. Uh, I had to train. I had to train them up somehow, you know. <sighs> okay, so we can go back to... Also, we got the old rod. I know you saw it at the beginning. That means we can go back to any city that we visited already and do a little bit of fishing. I'm pretty sure every town that we visited so far that we didn't get an encounter in has a body of water so we can do some fishing. So when we do, when we do revisit, I'll check the root tracker just to make sure that we didn't already get an encounter there. And then um, we'll get our encounter there, I guess. Uh-oh, our first battle. I'm full of pep, and my Pokemon is peppy too. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? What you got? What you got, Camper Travis? Which your meta type? Which your meta type having self? He has fighting type attacks. Let's get tough out of there for Beacon. All right, Beaks, you're up. Meditate. Meditate. The attack rose. Here we go. How about you hold this gust for me? Detect. How clever. How clever. All right, here's a gust. Hold this gust for us, fam Yeah. 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 Good work, Beaks. Proud of you. Proud of you. My Pokemon lost its pep. Oh, yeah. Keep it moving, Shouty. Uh, let's see. We have two directions that we can go. We either continue up here or we can go this way. We actually can't go this way just yet. There's a barrier in the form of a desert. The sandstorm is vicious. It's impossible to keep going. All right. So we won't be able to go through the desert just yet, and that's fine. We'll move on. Here's Route 112. Opportunity for another encounter. What we got? What we got? Hey. Hey. It's Krabby. It's Krabby. We recently caught a water type, but that's okay. We can still catch another one. There's nothing stopping us from catching another one. Krabby's pretty dope. Krabby's pretty dope. All right, Jolt. Do your worst. And by your worst, I mean don't kill it. Just make it so it's not going to go anywhere, please. Just make it so it's not going to go anywhere, please. There's a vice grip. Damn! That was a crit. Okay. Sure, I need you to hold the fort for us one good time. Hold the fort for us. <laughs> Let's see. I was going to say, let's encore it up. Let's safeguard one good time. Just one good time. Vice grip. Okay. All right, so Vice Group didn't do so much against Sure. That's perfect. Perfect. Here's a great ball. Oh, this great ball for us, family. All right. Did it. Didn't have to risk anybody dying. Let's check Krabby's Pokedex entry. It's the River Crab Pokemon. Krabby live on beaches, burrowed inside holes dug in the sand. On sandy beaches with little in the way of food, uh, these Pokemon can be seen squabbling with each other over territory. Interesting. Uh, Krabby. This is Krabby. This is Terry. After territory. Terry the Krabby in the PC. All right, dope. Let's see if we can continue up this mountain on this route. This is Mount Chimney. For Lava Ridge Town or the Summit, please take the cable car. You got it, family lamb. Uh, we need to heal Jolt before we get into a situation where we need him and he is not ready. We need to heal Jolt. Uh, let's let it ride right there. My legs are solid from pounding up and down the mountains. They're not going to buckle easy, friend. All right. All right. He obviously wants this work. 
Let's give it to him. He's got an execute, and we've got Tough up front. How wonderful. All right, Tough. I'm, I'm going to sit you on the bench just for a hot second. Here's Beacon. Here's Beacon. Tough and Beacon are battle buddies. They, they're they definitely battle buddies. In the event that Tough cannot handle it, Beacon definitely can every single time. Yeah. Yeah. It's an uproar. Don't worry about it. We're familiar with how it works. We're familiar with how it works. Come on. Come on. It's a Magnemite. Uh, is this one? No. Yeah, this one's for Beacon. Magnemite can't learn Earthquake. That's silly, chill. Or do we send out Volt? I think we send out Tough. I think we send out Tough. We'll let Tough have his day in the sun. Come on. It's a tackle. All right, let's test out that Rockhead ability with Takedown. How you missed, fam? How you missed, fam? There you go. That Rockhead, though. Sonic Boom! It always does 20. All right, hold this Metal Claw. Yeah, yo. Yeah, yo. All right. Abra's up next. It shouldn't be able to do anything. I don't believe Abra can learn anything in this game just yet before it evolves. I'm pretty sure. Teleport. It's not going to work, family. It's not going to work. There you go. There you go, tough. Proud of you, big dog. I'm proud of you. Not to. All right. So he wants to get the work from Jolt. Here's Jolt, since you asked for it. A leer. Come on. Here's Spark. Perfect. Bad effect. All right, team. Ouch. My legs cramped up. One excuse. One excuse. Okay, we need to do some stuff inside of Mount Chimney. <laughs> I was going to say we need to go back and heal. Well, let's get into this battle. Let's have a battle. Come on. Dust Skull. Interesting. All right, headbutt's not going to work. Takedown's not going to work. Here's a Metal Claw. Hold this Metal Claw for us, fam lamb uh oh, it held it. Astonish. Come on. Ooh, we might have levitate. Let's keep with the metal claw. Let's keep with the metal claw. Good work, tough. Good work. And a loudred. We're familiar. Ooh, we're familiar. Is it roll? No, no. It's sure it's turn. It is not Roll's turn. It's Shure's turn. Come on. Uproar. Perfect. Perfect. And let's counter. Yeah. Yeah. He's making an uproar. And what we're going to do here is an encore so that it's stuck in its uproar. Because I think this turn will be the one that it would let go. But you can't. You can't. Here we go. Come on. Come on. Yeah. He calmed down. No, not yet. Let's heal up. Let's heal up. Because we know there's more encore coming. I'm sorry. More uproar coming. You can't. Come on. You are stuck. And now you are stuck. Come on. Good work, sure. I'm proud of you. Oh, you're so strong. Shut up. I'm trying to go heal. I'm not trying to deal with y'all and y'all shenanigans right now. We're going to go heal very quickly. All right. That was the quickest heal. <laughs> that was the quickest heal. Let's go back up Mount Chimney. 
Let's see. We need to head left, I believe. To the right would be to get into the cable car. Yeah. And if I'm not mistaken, there are gentlemen blocking our way, it seems. Gentlemen in red hoods. Let's make our way into Mount Chimney, where, of course, we have another opportunity for an encounter here in the fiery path. Uh, let's see. Let's put Joe up front, of course. Let's see. We need to make our way through the fiery path. This is kind of dangerous. This feels like we're inside a volcano, if you ask me. A fiery path on the side of a mountain. That spells volcano. Who we got? Curlia. Curlia would be a great addition to the team if not for Mask. So it traced our lightning rod. We can't hit it with electric attacks, I believe. I believe we can't catch it with spark. Teleport. Well, I didn't expect teleport to happen. I will tell you that much. Did not expect that to happen. Well, there goes the fiery path. There are... Oh, these are Petra Berries and Ross Berries. I'm going to leave those simply because we don't need them just yet. Route 112, or Route 112. Did we get an encounter for that? Does that count as Krabby? Yeah, I believe that's Krabby. That still counts for Krabby. So we're not going to run the grass here as much as we can avoid it. And then back on 111. Okay. They've got encounters for all of these routes here. Moving past this young man. Let's talk to this young man. What's that? What am I doing? I'm thinking about making my own room here using a Pokemon move. I know. I'll give you this TM. Will you use it and make your own room? If the game lets me. If the game lets me. Usually this is what? Secret power or nature power? One of the two. Uh, it lets me use the environment to make like secret areas they're pretty fun pretty cool but it doesn't have really bearing any bearing on the game find a big tree that looks like it might drop some vines use secret power in front of the tree some vines should get free and drop down so you can climb the tree you'll find a lot of space for putting your favorite things it'll be your own secret room a secret base you should make one too another thing you don't always have to have your secret base in a tree try using secret power on rock walls that have small indents in them I'm going to look for other places, too. Okay, bye. So I wonder if it did actually give us secret power. I think I have this set up so that if it's a move that we can use in the overworld, like secret power or dig, we should be able to still use it. Yes, it still gave us secret power. Okay, this was the TM that the people in Slateport were so picky about us having before they considered us one of them. I don't know that I want to be considered one of them right now, to be quite honest. Let's walk in this woman's house. Oh dear, dear. Aren't your Pokemon exhausted? If you like, rest up here. That's a fine idea. You should do that. Okay. That's right. Take your time and rest up. Oh dear, dear. Are your Pokemon still tired? You should take another rest here. That's a fine idea. You should do that. No. Leave me alone. What's funny about her is if you're here... With the turbo button, if you're speeding up through the game, and you you can potentially get stuck there, you know, because you're pressing the button so many times. Let's see. Well, oh, these are orange berries. Let's take those. Those have been very beneficial. Those have helped us out in times of great need on our journey so far. All right. So we got four more orange berries to give the team. Let's let's attach those now. Let's have them hold. Let's have them hold the orange berries. Beacon, you can get you another berry. Everyone else holding something? Oh, no, Roll's not. Hold that for us, Roll. All right. Route 113. Right after this battle. Oh, your Pokemon look like serious actors. I have to ask you for an engagement. That's a very fancy way of saying she wants to battle. That's a very fancy way of saying she wants us to kick her ass. Here we go. Wing goes up front against our Jolt. Proud of y'all. Proud of y'all for the setup. Here's a spark. We're not even going to waste time with the Thunder Wave. Good work. Good work. Torchic. Torchic. Uh, I think we just got to ride this one out with Joel. Here's another. Here's another spark. 
It shouldn't kill. Oh, came close. Came close. Focus energy. Whatever she, he uses next will hit. It's a super potion. It's a super potion. All right, let's try it again, Jolt. And this time, go for the spark. There we go. There we go. Proud of you, big dog. Next up. Dust Tox. Oh, Dust Tox. Is it poison and bug or poison and flying? Let's find out. It's a protect. Here we go. Try it again, Jolt. It's a protect. Jolt, let's go. Let's do it this time. Damn. Okay, so it's not flying type. Let's catch it with a rock smash then. Let's pound that. Uh, we're switching you out, fail. Beacon, you're up. I brought you dinner. I brought you dinner. Confusion. Oh, it, ooh, it was a crit. Here's a gust. Hold this gust for us, fam lamb If you don't get... If you don't get... They didn't just look strong. They are strong. I mean, duh. Duh, we're on our way to being Pokemon Masters. 113. Oh no. It's a new route. So we get another opportunity for an encounter. Who's up front? Let's leave Joel up front for now. What we got? What we got? A Spoink! Spoink is dope! I love having Spoink on the team. Let's go to work. Here's a Thunder Wave. Come on. Uh, gamma. Psy wave. All right, Joe. We need some quick attacks. Oh, this slew. All right, one more. One more quick attack just might kill it. So we're gonna throw the ball here. Where we at? Great ball. Let's great ball it up, boys. Dope, we got a spoink on the team. We got us a spoink on the team. Spoink is the bounce Pokemon. Spoink bounces around on its tail. The shock of its bouncing makes its heart pump. As a result, this Pokemon cannot afford to stop bouncing. If it stops, its heart will stop. That's interesting. Spoink, this is... This is Jewel, the spoink. Not bad. All right, so this area, for those of you wondering, has ash that's falling uh, onto the grass. Once again, we're on the side of a mountain. We just went inside a hot path in a mountain. Now we're still on the side of that very same mountain. A uh, volcano, I should say. So the ash is falling from the, 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 the magma, the lava that has erupted and is now coming down as ash. Or soot, I should say. All right, we got to be careful here. There's a lot of, like, hidden trainers. Uh, do we... We don't need to heal any statuses, which is good. I hate I hate healing statuses. The days I wake up and say, God damn it, I got to heal a status. Those are my sad days. Oh, Lord, we're going to keep running into the points here, aren't we? Oh, and they got Chikorita here as well. How adorable. How adorable. Let's get the hell out of here. Let's get the hell out of here. I, sh I, I should have bought those repels. I wasn't thinking. I, I was in the need of buying repels a few episodes ago, and, and I still haven't done it. I'll, I've learned my lesson. I'll go buy some repels as soon as possible. All right, we snuck past her. There's a double battle there. Is anybody near evolving? To be honest, I'm not sure what level anybody on this team evolves at. Except uh, Beacon. I think I'm familiar with what level Beacon evolves at, but I'm not sure what anybody else evolves at. We're, we're really just riding this one out.
Okay, I've learned my lesson. We're gonna get repels as soon as possible. This area is covered in volcanic ash. Oh, puff. I'm specially gifted. Oh, puff. I make glass out of volcanic ash and make items. Oh, puff. Go collect ashes with this. Oh, puff. We got the suit sack. Just take that suit sack and walk through piles of ash. Oh, puff. And it will fill up with the volcanic ash. Oh, puff. Once you think you've collected a good amount, come see me. Oh, puff. He'll build things using the ash, which is interesting, but we're not going to be doing that just yet. Not just yet, if at all. All right. And I think we did it. We made our, yeah, we made our way through Route 113. And we're now in Fall Arbor Town. Okay, before we do a little bit of explorizing here, now's as good as time as any to save. <laughs> we'll save it. I think we can call it here. We've, we've done a lot of adventurizing. We've we've expanded the team a little bit. And we've, we've made it to a new city. Okay, guys. If you enjoyed this episode of the Pokemon Ruby Nuzlocke and would love to see more, then all you have to do is hit that red button below this video. That's that subscribe button. And turn on notifications. That way you get notified whenever a video uploads to the channel or whenever we do something special like a live stream. That way you can see everything that Alt Play has to offer. Thank you for checking this out, and I'll catch you later with more here on Alt Play. Team's coming along greatly. I'm actually really proud of the team.